I mean, I asked about uh, how do you know if it's a personal truth? So let me touch on that, man. <clears throat> Only you will be able to answer that question. But to answer that question, man, you've got to look within yourself. All right. Now, say if it, you, know, you don't know if you've experienced it or not. Any time in your life that you've run across a situation or been in a spot where you became so at peace, so happy, that nothing, nothing could touch you. Any time that you was in this spot that you wanted the whole world to know it. You wanted to scream it from the rooftops. You wanted them to feel what you feel, to understand what you understood. It's like having that one piece of the puzzle that fits off into the mosaic of life and every aspect of your life comes into focus. And once you, once you gain it, it is forever there. Unless you throw so much doubt into your own belief that you lose it. And you can lose it because you can get to the point where you question it so much and throw so much doubt out there that you're like, maybe, maybe it really wasn't a truth. We're the only ones that can take our truths away. We're the only ones that can truly take our inner peace away. And we do it more than anybody else can. Oh, man. We listen to so much others. We, sit, we listen to so many other people, man. We take their seeds of doubt and we internalize them and we sit there and mull over them and all this stuff. And we let them grow. We water the negativity of other people within ourselves, and it chokes out the positive a lot of times. Our own personal truth and our own individual peace can be destroyed only by the stuff that we let take root within our life. Love y'all. Stay blessed.